And I'm Noah C. Today is Monday, April 25th, and we're here with your morning announcements. Attention seniors, if you're with Ms. Bettencourt at the House Teachers at Seniors, please stop by Library 3 to pick up your time capsule during late lunch. The time capsules will be in boxes in the entry hall of Library 3. Are you wondering if you have a library fine or what to do with your AP textbooks? Are you a senior and wondering what to do with your Chromebook? Well, you're in luck because that information is posted online on the library website. Scan the QR code shown to go to the library website. Theo's Community Club is hosting a food drive until May 16th. Drop off any canned or non-perishable food items to the culinary classroom for a chance to earn a CO ticket. Five students who donate the most items will also earn a Dutch Bros drink. Now let's pass it on over to Sterling for our weekly weather report. <laughs> Good morning, I'm Sterling and I'm here with your weather update. Today we can expect a high temperature of 82 degrees with a low of 51 with winds going, about, with, with winds going southwest at about 10 to 15 miles per hour. Going into the rest of this week, high temperatures are mostly in the mid 70s to low 80s and low temperatures being in, in the mid 40s to low 50s. Well, that's all I have for you today humans. Back to Noah and Isabel. Thanks, Sterling. Attention AP students, are you taking an AP test this year and looking for ways to study? Well, you're in luck because the library has AP study books. Just be sure to bring your physical student ID card to check them out. The Sacramento Public Library has digital study guides as well as test banks to be used as well. Just Google Sacramento Public Library AP tests and log in once you are told to do so. Forgot your library card number? Just live chat or call the Sacramento Public, Public Library for help. There are also digital study guides on the reading apps Hoopla and Libby. For more information, stop by the library. Good luck on your AP tests, Wolfpack. Juniors and seniors, are you interested in earning a salary for on-the-job training as a California apprentice? Or for your future career, are you planning to earn a one-year certificate, a doctorate, a four-year degree, or community college transfer to a local or distant college? If so, come and explore your future job and career opportunities at the Spring 2022 Career and College Fair this Thursday, April 28th from 6.30 to 8 p.m. at Valley High School. Take a picture of the screen to get the registration link. Now let's pass it on over to Ashley for more information about the new tennis court construction. Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Ashley Horton, and as you can see, the tennis courts near the HK building have been ripped out. Of course, by the time you have seen this footage, additional fencing should have been added. Either way, students should be respectful not to interfere with the construction workers for safety reasons, as well as for the productivity of the crew. By the end of June, we should have new tennis and pickleball courts. That's all I have for you today, Wolfpack. Back to Andrews. Thanks, Ashley. The Amanda Gorman Future Voices Poetry Contest applications are now open. The deadline to apply is just around the corner on May 1st. Scan the QR code shown to apply or to get more information. This Wednesday, from April, this Wednesday April 27th, from 10 a.m. to 10 p.m., Wolfpack Boosters is hosting a fundraiser at Panda Express. Take a picture of the screen for more information. Man, I'm getting really hungry. What about you, Noah? Definitely. In fact, before we go, let's check out this week's Cooking with a Pack. Welcome back, Little Pack. This morning, we are making puff pastry apple danishes. So we're going to start with some apples. We're going to dice them up, cook them down, and then stick some uh, danishes in the oven. So we're going to stick these in a pot, a little bit of brown sugar, some salt, some cinnamon, and a little bit of cornstarch. We'll let these cook down. So now we have some puff pastry dough. We're going to use our pizza cutter and cut about four nice thin strips. Alright. 
you get stiff, you're gonna stretch it out just a little bit. So puff pastry is super forgiving. And then we're gonna twist. So I'm gonna twist towards me and away from me. Create this beautiful twist in the dough. And then we're gonna wrap it around itself. Tuck the butt under, push it a little bit, make room for our apple filling. Let's do that four times. And I'm Noah Seed, and remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Have a marvelous Monday, Wolf Pack. <laughs>